Hi, I just want to jump on real quick as I am just having my first steep of my brew tea monthly subscription. I chose to have the oolong because usually I really like oolong. First thing I noticed when I opened it was that the leaves look a lot different to the usual oolongs that I've had. But you can see the leaves. They're really, really fresh. And when I brewed it, or steeped it, they unfolded into full a full leaf. Now a lot of the teas that I have don't usually do this because I'm really into flavoured teas. So the other oolongs that I currently have, I have one from True Tea, which is the maple syrup oolong, and I have one from Bird and Blend, which is an elderflower prosecco oolong, both of which are flavoured oolongs. I do really like a lot of flavoured tea. So the maple syrup from True Tea looks like mm, a typical black loose leaf tea. But then this is the oolong from Bird and Blend. Okay. There's lots of different things in this one. This one has Chinese oolong tea, elderflower, lemon, uh, apple pieces, orange peel, lemon peel, hibiscus and rosehip. You can see lots of good things. And I think out of all of that, this, if it'll focus, that's your oolong piece. So it's similar to the true tea, but it seems like it's a bit more of a better quality. And this is my first month having the brew monthly subscription. And I just can't decide whether or not to try it for a second month. You can go onto their website and customize your preferences. So I might do that because I did get a blend, a herbal and the oolong this time. And I do really like flavored teas and I specifically, especially <laughs> like black teas and things with caffeine in them. So the herbal's not top of my list. The thing for me with the Bird and Blend, not this one, this is a separate tea that I ordered. With the Bird and Blend, you get three packs of 20 grams. With the True Tea, even though I did cancel it, you got four packs of 20 grams. And with the Brew, I've got three packs, and then two of them are nine, no, two of them are 14 grams, and one of them is only seven grams. So you are getting a lot less tea for the 10 pounds that you're paying. I'm not sure I can justify that. However, the tea itself does taste really nice. Really smooth. It's a very nice oolong. I think it's actually possibly the first plain oolong that I've tried. And I do like it. Which is why it's, oh, it's a hard do I, don't I, at the moment. Let me know if you've tried the brew subscription for more than a month. And if you've customised it and how it gets as you go on and maybe I'll make my decision from that. All right, have a good day.